Hello investors, my name is Dehan. Welcome back to your number one place for all your investing needs. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the top five potential altcoins to buy right now. So in the past 24 hours, the market is green, guys. So it's up about one and a half percent right now. In the past 24 hours, our top gainer is going to be Avalanche once again, two days in a row. This one is still booming. So we covered this one actually yesterday. And it says right now, it says it's up about 24%. If we take a look here on a 24-hour chart, it's actually up about 29%. So last night when we talked about this one, it was trading down here actually at around $20 or $22 already. So it went from $22 to $30 since we made the video. So if you guys are, you know, not watching my videos, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you don't miss out on potential runners like that. So Avalanche, definitely a momentum play right now. Bitcoin, it's pretty much flat. Ethereum is pretty much flat as well in the past 24 hours. So Bitcoin's still around that 44, 45,000 area. Ethereum still running around that 3,000 area. Then we have, you know, altcoins, you know, all about flat or so. Then we have some, you know, outperformers. I mean, Ripple, Doge is up. Solana, one of our greener coins that we've been following lately, it's been on fire. It is up 10%. Luna, we talked about this one last week, over 30% higher, even though the market is pretty much flat. And then we'd see down here ICP, 7.5% or so, 29% on Avalanche, like we said. And then obviously we have some more runners going on that we'll discuss as we get further on to this video. But before we get into this video, guys, smash that like button for me. Let's aim for 150 plus likes on this video. I know you guys can do it. Just tap that like button real quick. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on that bell notification so you get notified every time we make a new video. We're aiming for 40,000 subscribers. We're almost there, guys. And if you guys want to sign up for Webull, get your two free stocks valued up to $2,300. Links go in the description for that as well and leave a comment below. What crypto are you buying right now? Now let's get into it guys So the first altcoin on our list is gonna be Kusama. So KSM. So this one right here is at two and a half percent higher in the past 24 hours It is trading at two hundred and eighty two dollars right now in the past week This one is up over five percent past month 55 percent very nice gains here from about hundred and forty two dollars all the way to about highs up here of over $319 so over a hundred percent profit was made in a matter of a month or so so a thousand dollar you know investment into Kusama is worth around two thousand dollars right now so you would have made a hundred percent gains which is insane just to think about those are some you know huge numbers right there to get obviously in the crypto market you can see that very fast as you guys saw luna is up 30 percent just in one day which is insane you don't get movements like that in the stock market unless there's some crazy earnings going on in a smaller stock or something like that or some fda news on a penny stock now this one in the past year is up over 2200 percent it was trading at around $14 last August, went up here to highs of over $623 on our previous, uh, you know, crypto uh, bull run that we saw here in May. Then we obviously pulled back down with the rest of the market, traded sideways, and now we're seeing this upside. Market cap on Kusama is very, very low. So this one could definitely, you know, continue to go higher. I would not be surprised to see this coin go up to $1,000 per coin in the future, obviously, which would bring it to about a $10 billion market cap. So right now, $2.4 billion market cap, volume in the past 24 hours at $295.8 million. And then the circulating supply of coins, 8.5 million coins. Definitely a coin that I will be watching. Um, in my opinion, it still hasn't ran as hard as some of these other altcoins. And with that market cap being so low, it has the potential to be a huge runner in the future and something that we do not want to miss out on. So Kusama, add this to your list as the number one coin on the list, guys. Second coin is going to be Cosmos, also known as Atom. So very popular coin. We've talked about this one in the past videos. Uh, this one is up about 26.5% the past 24 hours. Even though the market is pretty much trading flat in the past 24 hours or so, we have altcoins surging. So it's altcoin season right now, it looks like, and everything is booming. So we hit highs up here of over $20 at one point. Right now, it is just under $20. In the past week, it's up over 36% past month 81 percent guys it was trading at eight dollars 96 cents if you would have bought here at the bottom on july 20th once again you would be up over 100 percent profit so the pattern that i'm seeing with these altcoins they're all pretty much up 100 percent or higher in the past month or so pretty much any you know coin that we've talked about in the past week uh when we look at the chart it's up over 100 percent from the low to the high in the past month so it's insane pretty much any altcoin that you bought you would be up even on, on the bigger coins like ethereum it almost made a you know 80 or 90 percent gain in a matter of a month so it's insane that anything pretty much would have returned some huge profits for you guys in the past month 
Now, in the past year, this one's up 251% from $5.61 last August, hitting highs here of $32 in May. Obviously, huge pullback, consolidated, and now we're seeing this uptrend. Uh, we're going to be looking for that you know, $20 area to break through the resistance and continue to go on higher. Market cap on this one, $4.2 billion. Volume in the past 24 hours at $756.8 million. Now, Cosmos is a cryptocurrency that powers an ecosystem of blockchains designed to scale and inter interoperate with each other. The team aims to create an internet of blockchains a network of blockchains able to communicate with each other in a decentralized way. Cosmos is a proof-of-stake chain. Atom holders can stake their tokens in order to maintain the network and receive more Atom as a reward. So obviously you get more you know, rewards, which gives you in return more Cosmos coins, which is great. That means you get more coins just for owning coins. And that's definitely something that we like to see because uh, you're making pretty much passive income just by holding a coin that you believe in for the future. And especially if you're a long-term holder, you don't even have to worry about it because uh, you plan on holding no matter what the price does in the short term. So Cosmos is definitely a beautiful coin to be adding and watching on your list as well. The third altcoin is going to be one that we talked about actually recently. And it's just so, you know, it's been on a bull run, I guess you could say a bullish type run. And we just have to discuss it because it's a very popular coin. I know a lot of you guys love this coin. It's going to be Cardano, ADA. So this one in the past 24 hours, up 10%, even though the market is flat. It's trading at over $2.50 now. Finally, we're breaking through again uh, through that, you know, high that we saw a few days ago. 19% in the past week. In the past month, 81% from lows of $1.03. Once again, over 100% profit in the past month or so on Cardano. In the past year, it's up over 1,564%. Here, we saw highs at about $2.50 on May 15th. So that is the area we're going to be looking to break through for the next resistance area, obviously. Now, this one is a larger cap coin. It is uh, at a $68.6 .6 billion market cap right now. So it's on the higher side, guys. It takes a lot more momentum and a lot more movement and money to move this one on the higher side. Volume in the past 24 hours is huge, though. Over $5 billion, as you guys can see right there. Cardano is a blockchain platform built on a proof-of-stake consensus protocol that validates transactions without, you know, without high energy costs. Development or Cardano uses the Haskell programming language, which is described as enabling Cardano to pursue evidence-based development for unparalleled securities and stability. So you guys already know about Cardano, obviously. I actually made a poll on my channel asking you guys which one of which altcoin is your favorite and cardano pretty much destroyed every other altcoin that i put on that list now i would show you it but the poll is actually glitched right now and it's not showing the results but cardano blew it out of the water so it seems like a lot of people believe in cardano as one of those top altcoins for the future uh what do you guys think let me leave a comment below do you own any cardano in your portfolio just leave a comment below and i'll reply to your comment now the fourth altcoin is going to be icp internet computer so this one you might be asking why am i adding this to the list it's a momentum play type situation just like with ethereum classic that we discussed this is a momentum play so usually when altcoins surge these certain altcoins like ethereum classic internet computer they tend to surge as well very very quickly you know in a blink of an eye before you can even see it so definitely one that i'm going to be watching it's up 7.88 percent here in the past 24 hours trading at 62 dollars in the past week it's actually down eight percent past month up 91% from high lows down here of $26. Once again, over 100% profit on ICP as well. Under one year chart, 185%. So we saw this one, you know, blow up here over $750 on May 9th. Then we saw a comeback down to lows, which was just an extreme, you know, pump and dump situation in my opinion, but it still has potential for that run, obviously, just like Ethereum Classic. 8.5 billion of, of market cap right now, volume at, in the past 24 hours at 537.7 million. ICP is a utility token that allows users to participate in and govern the internet computer blockchain network. The network aims to help developers create websites, enterprise IT systems, internet services, and DeFi applications by installing their code directly to their public internet. ICP can be staked or converted into cycles that can be used to power computation for dApps and traditional applications so a lot of you guys are familiar with staking and you know it's pretty much you're locking up your coins for a certain amount of interest i guess you could say a certain percentage for a certain amount of time and you get it back for just for holding those coins and you're staking them so obviously for long-term holders long-term investors staking is definitely a beautiful thing in my opinion and this is a beautiful coin for uh you know uh i guess a momentum of type run to to watch in the next few weeks to see if it's going to pop like some of these other altcoins are right now and then our last altcoin is going to be VeChain, V-E-T. 
This one, it's a little bit slower, guys, but it still has momentum. 3.4% higher in the past 24 hours. In the past week, 7.7%. In the past month, 77.4%. From lows down here, about $0.06. Cents. So from $0.06 cents to $0.12, cents, that is 100% gain once again. So pretty much all of these coins that we talked about, all five of these altcoins, 100% gains on each one of these in the past uh, month. So you pick your poison, guys. Pretty much that's what the situation right here is. Whichever one you pick, it was doing very well in the past month. 7.7 .7 billion market cap on this one, 1.5 or 1.1 billion volume right there, 570% higher in the past year as he was trading around one or two pennies last year. Went up here to highs of about 28 cents at one point in April, and then obviously the pullback. So there's still plenty of room to go. Um, it would be around a you know 15 billion market cap if it was to get back to these prices. Uh, but uh, definitely one of those lower market cap coins to be watching. VeChain is a cryptocurrency and a smart contract platform focused on supply chain management. It allows manufacturers to add sensors such as RFID tags to their products that can then record data onto the VeChain blockchain. Very popular coin and one to add to your radar, guys. So guys, those are the five altcoins that we're going to be watching in the next few days. Obviously, market is up 1.5%, like we said. We see a lot of momentum plays that are up, you know, even these altcoins surging 10, 20, 30% or so in a matter of 24 hours. Now, what is the rest of the market doing? So let's take a look. Ethereum, like we said, it's pretty much trading sideways in the past 24 hours, up and down momentum. In the past week, it's down 4.5%. Past month, up 59%. And then on the one-year chart, it is up 639%. So like we said, from lows of 1,700 this month, all the way to highs of about, 3300 almost 3400 which would bring it to about a 90 to 95 percent gain in a matter of a month so just like i said with these altcoins you know huge you know gains were even made with ethereum uh 355.2 billion volume right now and just like doge guys so we even talked about doge similar pattern if you take a look here doge this one is up about 3.7 percent in the past 24 hours um right here it's at 30 cents Past week, 14%. Past month, 66%. But here at the low, it was about $0.16. Cents, and here at the high, over $0.35. Cents. So 100% profit on Doge as well. So pretty much everything except Bitcoin made 100% profit that we talked about in today's video. $39.8 billion volume, or actually market cap, with $5.8 billion volume on Doge. So Doge is still holding up right now. And then we have Bitcoin, obviously. $846.4 billion uh, market cap with $31.3 billion volume. So volume holding steady. We're still up there with the volume being high uh you know it's trading sideways pretty much for the past week going up and down so we're waiting to see if it's going to break through and get back into the high 40s or if we're going to see the low 40s first and potentially go lower we're hoping for it to go obviously to the higher 40s and potentially even kiss 50 that would be very nice to see now in the past month uh, Bitcoin went from 29,000 all the way to 45,000, which is not 100%, guys. So it did not go 100% like these other altcoins, obviously. It went up about 50% or so. So still very nice. I mean, 50% gains in a month is insane to me. I, at least, I'm be, obviously, you know, I'm not going to be, you know, greedy and look for 100%, 200%, 300%, 50%. Those are beautiful gains, in my opinion, in a matter of a month. I mean, that's insanity. So I would definitely, you know, sign that any day, invest all my money and get 50%. I would do it in a heartbeat if it was guaranteed. In the past year, 280%. Still far away from those highs at around 65,000 that we saw in April. But we're slowly getting there, guys. So this, you know... Potential bull run is continuing. We're seeing a lot of these altcoins continue to go higher, like we said. So things are looking good. A lot of these coins are coming out now, and a lot more momentum is happening. Just imagine what is going to happen as more people get into crypto, because I believe they did a survey somewhere where they surveyed a certain amount of people, and less than 10% of the people were actually invested into crypto. I believe it was close to like 6 or 8%, which is just, just insane. Imagine once you know we have 20, 30, 40% of the U.S. population getting into crypto. That would be insane, guys. So guys... Those are the altcoins we're going to be looking at. Obviously, I'm not a financial advisor, so none of this is financial advice. This is all for entertainment purposes only. Before investing, speak to your financial advisor and do your own due diligence. There's always a high-risk, high-reward type situation when you are trading crypto. Now, as always, guys, if you enjoyed this type of content, smash that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on that bell notification so you get notified every time we make a new video. And as always, if you want to sign up for We Won't Get Your Two Free Stocks Valued Up to $2,300, links are in the description. And leave a comment below. What crypto are you going to be buying and looking at in the next few weeks? And is Bitcoin going to get back up? to the all-time highs in 2021. I hope you guys have a great day and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.